Good morning, everyone. Today is Saturday, July 6th, 2019. It's officially seven months of keto for seven. Bill and I. Seven. It's yep. crazy. Crazy, crazy. Crazy easy, but crazy. Yeah, it's been easy. Yeah. I I'd say so. that's true. I think so. I think we've just kind of adapted it into a different lifestyle. It's you know, really yeah. a diet. I, even from day one, I was like, ah, let's just change what we're eating and the junk that we're eating, the processed foods and the sugary foods. That's made a huge difference, yeah. um, obviously. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Look at you. Look You're at amazing. you. <laughs> I think I, I'm Love a work in progress. <laughs> new shirt. Yeah. I've definitely gone from a 5 and a 6X down to about a 3X. So most, there's even a 2X in my closet now. But uh, yeah, we're, we're working on it. And Hashtag Stacey's, goals. Yeah, and Stacy's done, what, 18 down to about a 6 or an 8, depending on the pants. Yep. Yeah. So, yeah, we're getting And a there. size medium shirt from a size 18, 20 woman's. I think the hardest part for you is your bras keep changing because bras are hard for girls. <laughs> it's just got to go bra shopping like I every, hate bra shopping. every what, month and a half, month. <laughs> you've had to go bra shopping because just things aren't supporting you. Yeah, yeah. He supports me. I support you. <laughs> <laughs> so, so with our seven month update here, um, we are, like I said earlier in videos, every, the first Saturday of every month is when we'll do our monthly updates because it was getting out of, really out of sync when we were doing it every four weeks. Yeah. Um, <laughs> our weights. Let's our weights. Start, let's get right into the meat of it. Bill started in December 1st, 2018 at 382.6. Yes, I did. This morning. Right. I guess last week he he weighed in at 335.2, and this week he weighed in at 335.2. So he's a goose egg, but you didn't go but up. But I'll take a goose egg. Absolutely. Um, I do this other thing called Omada, which is through our insurance program, and you have to jump on the scale every day. If you don't, you start getting these messages and stuff. And uh, I was getting a little bit, a little bit frustrated because I was going up a couple pounds in the middle of the week. And I'm like, what the heck? I'm still following everything. I just, I don't know. My body does what it wants to do. It does. It's 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 strange how things. You happen. have Shark Week. I have Whale Week. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Just some some couple of days, and I'm like, what the heck? You know. And and then it all kind of started evening out again. And sure enough, for today, I ended up right on, on target. <laughs> so sorry, I gotta uh, have coffee. Drink your coffee. <laughs> a whale Week. Oh, that's a bad oh. coffee. Mm. Oh, I'm so yeah, sorry. I made, a, I made a bad coffee. <laughs> bad decisions. <laughs> make better, cho better choices. Better choices. Make yeah. good choices. <laughs> I made a shirt for my daughter that said, make good choices one day. <laughs> There's a story behind that. But. The scary thing is when you can make your own shirts. Yeah. Um, so, year to, um, from December 1st, 2018 to now, Bill's down 47 Point four pounds, which is ironic because Stacy's weight was. I started at one eighty point two on December first, two thousand eighteen. Last week I weighed in at one thirty five point two, and this morning I was happy. I weighed in at one thirty two point eight, so I'm actually down almost two and a half pounds from last hey. week. I didn't think that's so. That's that's a new low for me. Maybe because your shark week was over and you were kind of letting go of that fluid that you were holding last week. Yeah. Because you were really swollen. Your fingers were swollen and everything. Yeah. Although so this maybe. is this is the lowest I've been, the 132s. I have, I have oh, been great. 133 something, 1334, I think. So a little bit lower. So that's, so good. that's good. So Stacy's overall weight loss da -da -da -da. since December... First, 2018, at seven months here, is... Also, 47.4 pounds. Because we can't do something without <laughs> like being like neck and neck, I swear. We're so in sync with each other, so, it's kind of If funny. I was a girl, we'd be flown at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> so, so we're both down 47... Yeah, me too. Um, anyway, 47.4 pounds for you and 47.4 pounds for me. Which is great for you, and for me, it's good, too. It's great I, I need to get... Here's what I need to do. I need to reevaluate some things. My carb manager is point on. I don't eat or drink anything without putting it in carb manager. True. And it's accurate, because I'm scanning things, or I'm putting it in myself. However, I have 
somewhat faded from my 16-8 window. And once a week, I was doing at least a 24 to 30 hour fast mm -hmm. in that week. Our weeks have been crazy. We've been out of town for the last couple of weeks. We've gone out of town for at least two to three days. Right. And I have not done that. Uh, my window didn't open up too much, but it, it did open up because I was waking up hungry and I had to run the whole day. And knowing that I had to run the whole day, I might get some food in me. Right. So long story short, I'm going to just simplify back to my 16-8. And I'm going to get my one day of midweek, like Tuesday or Wednesday, yeah. of a fast in, at least 24, if not 30. And I'm going to see where we come in next week. And and I'm hoping that'll start showing on the, the scale and reflecting. You know, I think so. I'm heading back to my normal schedule um, So with work. So I'll work just four days a week. So I'll have four longer days. Um, but that's the usually the time that when Bill would fast would be... The longer day. Yeah, we got really um, out of whack here the last few weeks. Yeah, you know, and then it's been nice because I've been getting off earlier um, from Costco. However, it throws us eating later. So yeah. now that I'll go back to my regular schedule, I will eat lunch and dinner at work so Bill can eat earlier at home and then he can start that window again. So I think. Things will settle down here. We'll get back into that rhythm. Um, Bill will eat with the girls at night. Soon to be just Julia because Lauren's going to go back to school. Yeah. I think the key thing there is just, you know, noticing your issues, uh, adapting, you know. Yeah. Life is that way. You have to do that to life anyway. Absolutely. You know, there's always changes and you got to make the, you know, the adjustments for it. So, so we've recognized that and I'm hoping that I can start seeing my numbers um, in a positive way negative <laughs> in a negative positive way if you know what i mean absolutely um, yeah so in this last week we were actually in indiana for a couple of days um wait wait, wait. before what? we get to that yeah so inches oh yeah yeah you um, want to get all the information yeah out. so year to date um bill is down 17.75 inches um he is still at the same so he hasn't lost any inches from the, our six month update to now. So he's still at that 17.75 inches year to date. Um, but you haven't gone up in inches. Uh, well, so, that's you know, that's, that's a nice even. So we'll take it. Yeah. Just stay steady and on course. Yeah. So, and then for me, I am, uh, last month, um, I was at 27.75 inches, uh, and, this month, I am down another 0.75 inches, down to 27 inches total year-to-date. Not year-to-date. Year-to-date for keto. So seven months in keto, right. I am down a total of um, 27. 27. You're down 27, 27 or you are inches. 27? I'm at 27 inches lost oh, since we started. See, I didn't understand what you were saying. Yeah. So where am I at then? You're a total of 17.75 inches lost since December 1st, 2018. Oh, okay. And you've lost 27 inches. Is that because we do more measurements for you? You have like twice as many measurements as me. No, I have one more measurement, which is the boobies. <laughs> That's the only other okay. one. Okay. Yeah, just the boobies. So just that extra, whatever that is, right. also counts into why your number is higher in general? Yeah, higher in general, but I, I like my waist mm. went from big fat <laughs> to normal. Okay. <laughs> Mine's still kind of big fat. It's it's less big fat, but it's getting there. Well, it's I think it's yeah. a little different definitely for a girl than a guy. Um, we're going to lose it, you know. So, Obviously, the 47 point four pounds on me versus what looks very different found than you is, yes. right looks very so, different and you guys will see those pictures at the end of this video i'll put up the day one versus the ones we took this morning yes so no problem now what else do we have to go over before we can talk that is it no bmis right oh bmis i don't have bmis i forgot you didn't do the bmis I'm okay for i forgot well i guess i'll be adding them in to the text area after i go do the bmis for us Yes, because you sorry. said I'm taking care of everything, so I thought everything I, was taken care of. I did indeed. Yes, you and did I was excited say that. because you know what, we went out of town, and I was excited for a couple of things. Um, Bill got me a little red VW Bug convertible. <laughs> yeah, 
I had a buddy who was uh, had a uh, an extra car that they weren't using. It's just a really cute little v- VW uh, so cute. Beetle Bug, and it's an older car. It's a 2005, but uh, you know it's still running and all, and it looks cute as heck. And it's and, so uh, peppy. <laughs> we started we started doing some talking, and I said, "Well, I'll bring out a carload of guitars, and we'll work out something." You know, so I had Marshall amp and guitars, and you know. We just sat down and we figured it all out on paper and a little bit of cash, a little bit of guitars, a little bit of fun stuff. You know, so now he's got some new toys and I got some new toys. I have a new toy. Well, you have a new toy, yeah. I always so, benefit from the trades. Yeah, yeah, you do. <laughs> so, so yeah, that worked out really well. That's a fun little car. It it's is. really cute. It's super and, uh, cute. I'm thinking you'll have a lot of fun with that this summer. So I drove it home um, from Indiana and we stopped in Kalamazoo and we saw Kazoo Keto. Yeah, Greg and Stace. Greg and Stace. So that was really nice to finally meet Stacy and see Greg again. Um, we got to go for a bike ride on yeah, the we, e-bikes. We all went on the ride because they have a couple extra bikes. Their kids have bikes too. And uh, so we got Stacy on one of the e-bikes and uh, I was riding Greg's bigger e-bike and then he was riding one of the kids, I think, yeah. or just one of the other bikes because they have probably six of them. But uh so we went on a little trail. I think we did seven to eight miles yeah. total. Man, those bikes are so much fun. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I want one so bad. I gotta it figure out so a way to nice pay for it. But <laughs> to get back out on a bicycle with Bill, I should um, ask them if they want any guitars because I have a basement <laughs> full of guitars. Maybe I'll just sell a couple of guitars and buy a bike. Oh, <laughs> uh, that, that could be. And then Stacy gave me. Oh, that's bad coffee. Her- Oh, but I need it. You I need, need it. it. Stacy gave me her recipe for the little crack cookies that Bill ate the entire bag of yes. the last time he went down to visit. So we I need to try any. that. Yes. So we did our chocolate keto mug cake um, video. Yeah, I was very proud of you because I said, hey, can I, I kind of put you on the spot you last did. week. I'm like, hey, so you're going to do a video before July 6th? And you said, yes, I will. And so. I did. I was thinking, because I actually had a friend over who um, I was making my food for a couple days. And they said, wow, that smells amazing. And I'm just, for me, it's just my chicken that I make every day. But I do um, my own type of stubs rub now. It's just different spices. And then at the end, like with seven minutes left or so, I took it out and then I put a little bit of the uh, sugar-free honey mustard on it. And then I stuck it back in and that last six, seven minutes, I let that kind of glisten up and harden up a little on there. Oh my gosh, they smell amazing. They taste good. I thought maybe I'll even try my hand at a recipe because you're always gone. You're, you're gone during the day, but I'm home. So I can, you know, between making shirts and doing stuff with the kids, I can run up and set up the camera. I don't know how well it would turn out, but I could try it. So yeah. and it's a really simple recipe. I mean, I just throw the way I do a recipe versus the way she does a recipe. <laughs> Yeah, I might get I some, follow com- directions I might get some comments because I just eyeball stuff. I throw things in like, yeah, that's about a tablespoon, you know, but. If you want to see Bill do a recipe, put a comment in, uh, oh, down I'll, below. Oh, I'll do one, yeah. You will? Okay. I'll, I'll try. I'll just show. I, in fact, I have chicken upstairs that I have to make, and uh, uh, maybe I'll even do that today or something or tomorrow. Yay. I'll try and edit it up for tomorrow. Yeah, that would be kind of fun. fun. I don't know. I've never done a recipe on my own, especially even. So I'm a little nervous, but I'll try it. You can do it together. All they can do is not watch. Right. <laughs> they see my face on there like, wait, what's this? <laughs> and it's so funny because I'm such a picky eater. So I feel like. And she won't eat my chicken. <laughs> it's okay. He I love ch- it. It's more for me. <laughs> it's more for me. <laughs> he eats chicken thighs though. With the skin on it. I do like chicken thighs, and I like them with the skin on it. It gives me my fats, too. No, thank you. Yeah. Juicy. (laughs) Tender. Anyway, so there's nothing else on the sheet we need to go over at this point, right? No. Okay. No. Um, We got the little bug, which was really fun. Um, Went out and visited my mom's grave site, which Uh uh, is out in Indiana. And when she passed in February last year, uh, the ground was too hard. Everything. In fact, there was like water, ice, everything was hard as a rock. Yeah. So we were able to go back out and find out, you know, exactly where we were going and finally see the gravestone and everything. That was emotional and, you know, but it was something we wanted to do. So, and we even got a visit with your sister. 
Yeah. Uh, we went to Aurelio's Pizza, which we love, mm. and uh, did a little scraping. So we had a little pizza and had our little Aurelio's. But yes. we kept it keto, though. Yeah. So, yeah. Very good. It's one of the few places that I'll actually eat sausage. Yeah, um, so they're, they're they've got good sausage. sausage. Is good. Um, I don't know what it's about it, but I like it, so I'll eat it. Yeah, mm-hmm. and we had one or two other small little things that we did for with and for family out there. And oh, and we went for a massage together. Yes, we did. It's yeah. been a busy week. Yeah, yeah, we went and actually got the massage we were supposed to get. I think maybe three weeks ago or four weeks ago at this it's, point. Yeah, it's been a it's bit been ago. a while, and we finally did it. And we we just went and did it. And then yeah. It was helpful. I, I think I probably need three massages before I feel human again. Me too. Yeah. You should book them. We should do that again. Yeah. Right? There's a do lady. you guys agree with me? He should book us massages I do a website again. for a lady that has a massage therapy clinic and uh, one of the perks is that we can get some massages out of it. I never really take her up on it. I do. She does. Yeah. I maybe go once a year or once every two years. Not you me. You go every time you can, man. Yeah, absolutely. Every time you can. Go. I'm probably going to need it next week. After next week. What's next week? On Friday. Oh, that's right. Lauren, Logan, and I are going to Cedar Point. I'm so excited to go ride more coasters. Yeah. Logan is one of Lauren's Lauren's friends. best friends. So, um, yeah. so kind of like our adopted child. Yeah. Um, here all the time. Um, <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> but we're going to be going to Cedar Point for the entire day. They open at 10 a.m. until uh. midnight. Um, and I don't have to work at 8 a.m. on Saturday so I'm super excited so we could stay late and ride coasters Good. all day. And I'm not going because I don't fit, first of all. Second of all, I don't like roller coasters. So Julie and I will do something. Maybe we'll go see Toy Story 4 or something. Just, well, no, I guess we won't go see Toy Story 4. I want to well, see it. I'll take her and do something. Do like, something different. I'll take her to the mall or something. <laughs> let her let her go walk around the stores. Yeah, or do something different. I'd like to yeah, see Toy Story 4. Be active. That would be good. I wish she would ride a bike. Julia won't ride a bike. She is absolutely zero of children, interest in riding a bike. Yeah, this generation of children, a couple of good kids here in the neighborhood, they don't ride bikes. I don't get no. it. She's got a scooter, but she doesn't she want to ride the bikes. No, not at all. It's zero we have, interest. We, we even let her pick a bike out. She's like, oh, I like this one. So we got right, her the bike. The and bike. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> so... <laughs> I even cleaned up our old bikes, our, our, trek our treks. Bikes. Yeah, so I was out there yesterday cleaning them up and kind of going over all the nuts and bolts. And uh, I'm going to give it a try. I'm, I'm about 100 pounds less than the last yeah. time I tried to ride those a long time ago. So, but man, I really want the e-bike because just for the help that it gives for an old body like mine, <laughs> an overweight, older body. Yeah. Yeah, you're, you're pedaling along, but it assists you and it. There's such, there's, you just have to try it. Yeah. Yeah. To understand. They're, they're pretty cool. Yeah. Even you enjoyed it and you're a normal size. Yeah. Because it definitely helps. Especially when you're on a hill or something. It's like, oh. <laughs> and this thing just kind of like makes you feel like Lance Armstrong. <laughs> <laughs> or like a cyborg. Because you have these like legs that are powerful. I don't know. By this point, everybody's tuned out of the video anyway. They got all the information. <laughs> they don't want to see us or listen to us anyway. So No, probably not. This is just bad coffee time. BCT. <laughs> I love you. That's the worst cup of coffee I've made in months. Then stop drinking it. Oh, but I need it. <laughs> you don't understand. <laughs> Stacey doesn't I, drink coffee. I don't understand. I don't drink coffee. Yeah. Well, so I met um, a couple at Costco they had some questions. They were starting out keto last week, and I met them last week, and then I saw them yesterday. So they started their keto journey. Um, it was really cute. Um, so we talked and gave a couple um, hints and tips and uh, ideas. And um, you say we talked? It was just you and them. Yeah, oh. yeah. And uh, we were talking. How about did they come to find you? <laughs> our friend Chrissy. Oh, okay. She's like, they had questions and they were asking Chrissy and she's like, let me go get Stacy. She knows. So well, Chrissy should know too. She did keto, didn't she? I or does she, keto? I don't know. I, I think she did. Yeah. But okay. so what ended up happening is we started talking and I gave them our channel, Bonsai Keto. And last night they <clears> came in. So we were chatting and I was answering a few more questions for them. And then we were talking about pizza. I said, oh, get to the fathead pizza. And she's like, what's that? And I said, oh my God, <laughs> I said, go watch it's our video. <laughs> my absolute favorite pizza. Um, actually, yes. I have 
sauce upstairs and I, I have, have sausage already made in the freezer ready because knowing that you were going to be making pizza soon. Yes. Tuesday, right? I think it was Tuesday you said because you're off. Tuesday I'm off. So I, I'm looking forward to fat head on Tuesday because I can't make that stuff. If couldn't. I tried, no, 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 because no, 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 he doesn't no. follow the. Directions. I don't follow directions. I'm just, I'm just telling you. We'll get it. Um, I promise. When I do my chicken thing, I am going to measure things out with te teaspoons, tablespoons, whatever that stuff is, because I know how much I use, but I never measure it. So I'm going to write this stuff down. When I make it, I'm going to write it down, and then I'm going to put it in little bowls, and I'm going to say, okay, now I'm going to be like Stacy. I'm going to pretend I'm Aww. making a real video. <laughs> I don't know. This should be fun to see how it turns out because it might just be a mess. But that might be even funnier. But it tastes good. So I'm happy with that. So the end product is all good. I'll take it. You'll take it. I'll take it. Anyway, your couple. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to interrupt you. No, it's okay. So you were answering questions. So I answered some questions without talking to them about the fat head. And then there was another member who said, I was eavesdropping on your conversation. <laughs> And I heard that you had a YouTube channel. I said, I do. So I gave him the YouTube channel. Um, so he's, you know, been in and out of different diets and different, you know, losing, Trying different things, yeah. Yeah, losing weight in different, different ways. Um, so he seemed intrigued. Um, I don't know. So it was By pretty neat. into it. Yeah. Spread the word. And then two weeks, he might come back in and say, hey, I'm kind of looking into that whole thing. You know? Yeah. 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 So yeah. that was kind of neat. Um, I am almost to the end of the... My keto or the keto book? Oh, the uh, Doctor Axe. Yeah, Axe. Doctor yeah. Axe. Um, I think it's so, Josh Axe. Yeah, I think I have one and a half just left to go um, in his keto diet plan. His his keto diet. Plan. I don't know why that drives me nuts. It's like it's not your keto diet. You didn't create it. You didn't make it. But his keto. Well, it's his <laughs> keto diet plan. It's his book. It's his keto diet plan. Yeah. But he does make it sound like. He like created keto. He created keto, exactly. <laughs> does, so um, I'm excited. I think it's worse because it's an audio book. If you were reading it, you kind of pass by. But when you hear that audio of that over and over, you're yeah. like, really? <laughs> exactly. So I'm waiting to see what he has to say about the maintenance plan. And he talks a lot about the keto cycling. So Oh, yeah, where you're kind of... Yeah. Changing things up. So that that is something where you're at that point. Yeah. So maybe listen to a little of that. Absolutely. And see where you end up. So, yeah, we talked about some of the things that we have coming up for this week. Are you going to try and get a recipe in or anything? I'm not pressuring you. I just was curious if you have something on your mind. I'll try a chicken one. I don't know how it's going to work out. but I do. You know, I have. But See, yours yeah. are usually snacky stuff. Well, yeah. You know, and there's nothing wrong with snacky stuff, but I'm talking food, man. I eat food. I eat I like, food too. I like the snacks occasionally, you know, like, oh, that sounds really good. Yeah. But when it comes to food, I want food every day. That's what I want. Food. Food. You got to make me some taco seasoning mix. I will. You know, the little Ziploc bags. I will. I made a ground beef last night, so I'll do um, Do some me some taco, taco seasoning. seasoning baggies. Or, or I can go watch the video and try and do it myself. There you go. Watch the video. Yeah. Measurements and all are on that video. See, that's the problem. I didn't measure. I just, <laughs> that looks like about this much. I'm making more. Just put a little more in. He does. He always feels like more is better. Mike, more is not always better. More is better. Follow the directions. Portion control. That's why I'm still working on it. <laughs> I'm still working on it. So, oh, goodness. But yeah, I'll, I'll do a chicken video this week. I'll pro I'll commit to that. Chicken, chicken. And then uh, if you were going to commit to doing anything or to trying to do anything. I will. What would you commit to? Do you even have anything in mind? I have a couple things in mind. Are they all sweets? No. <laughs> Are most of them sweets? <laughs> um, I don't, I, it's not that that's a bad thing. It's just, you know, I was just curious. I have a sweet. I have a treat. No, um, well, the sweet pretzel treat. bites. Oh yeah, pretzel um, bites. We did those. Gosh, that was around the Super Bowl that you did. Yeah, those I, last. I made them, so I'll do a video for them because they were actually really were yummy good. with some queso cheese. Um, so that worked out really well. Um, yeah. and then you know I want to try bread. I, I'm liking my my Stacy bread. Oh, I call in the it. comments below, if you have a really good keto bread recipe, there yes. is something I, I remember. There's something. There's a reason for that too, uh, that you want the bread recipe. We won't, we won't share that quite yet, but. If you if you guys can help us find as close to a regular bread recipe that actually tastes and looks like bread, that would be interesting. That would be wonderful. Because yeah, so put those in the comments below, uh, link 
yeah. or, or something, a website, a link or something. Because once I find a good bread, then there will definitely be another video coming. Yes. And I, I want to eat at that point because there's something I want. It's one of my favorite things that I miss that I haven't had that I used to eat. Regular. All the time. Uh, yeah. So get regular. Me more than him. Yeah. But, but it does sound good though. So I'm, I'm up for it too. So yeah, help us get a bread recipe. Please. For the three people that are left watching this. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, Stacy's going to head off and I got a long day today too. Um, we got a lot of stuff going on. Yes. But uh, heck, I might even go up there and start monkeying with the uh, chicken stuff because I have to cook that. Either yeah, today or tomorrow. Not so, my job. I don't like to touch the chicken. Yeah. So at the end of the video, right after all this, you will see our pictures of day one versus day month seven. And uh, yeah. And I'll throw the BMIs in like I said earlier. Sorry. I must laugh. No, that. you're fine. You're fine. I just, when you said I got a sheet, we're all set. I'm thinking we got all our numbers. Was there anything else we're supposed to be doing on the monthly updates that we forgot, like the BMI? No, we the did BMI? the measurements. We did the year to dates. We did um, total loss. Total loss. Okay. Yeah. So I'm ready good. to be out of the 330s. Let me tell you, I'm ready. Me too. So I'm going to, like I said, go back to my 16.8. I'm going to get firmer on that. And I'm going to go back to the one day a week. And that's a commitment I'm making right now. At least 24, if not 30. If not, a little longer if... It's a pinky promise. If I'm not going crazy. Cool. <laughs> he can do it. He's yeah. done it. He knows he no, can I've do it. Yeah, I've done it. And it wasn't as bad as I right. thought as when I originally started keto and said, yeah, I'm not doing that. No, it's been fine. I just We've just been so busy and we've been out of town a lot. So yeah. it really throws you off. When you wake up in a hotel and you got to eat breakfast and run for 12 hours, you know it's time to fuel. Exactly. Well, if you're smart... <laughs> Hydrate and fuel. That's Absolutely. that's me. Today's hydrating is not doing so well. Not so well. My my, I, I, yeah. I made some coffee and it's bad. I don't know what I did wrong. It's really not good. As I keep drinking it, keep because drinking. I need to wake up. But that's not good. That's not good. All right, guys. Well, thank you. Thank we'll you see for you next watching. week, and we'll actually see you sooner than next week because I'm going to try and do a chicken video. It might be a disaster. It might even be where I need your help. Okay. Because if I totally mess it up, we'll just we use it in the you. outtakes. I'll put it at the end where I tried to do it myself. But but who knows? I might pull it off. You might pull it off. I don't know. Thanks for watching. Let us, let us know. Do you want me to see me try to do a recipe? I actually make decent food. I just don't do measurements and I just don't follow directions. He doesn't. I don't play well with others usually. Well, I play well with you. Aww. But yeah, that's what I used to get on my report cards. When Bill could get focused, he could do really well. Things like that. Yeah. I just, I'm one of those ADHD kids. I'm just like, I was undiagnosed, but I guarantee you. Focus. I guarantee you. Focus. Yeah. All right. I have to go. All right. See you later. See y'all. Bye. Bye.